Hi, and I hope you're having a great day wherever it is that you might be. I'm Larry Cole with the Dealer Institute, and I'm coming to you from Arkansas. And today we're going to be is we're going to talk about our third video in a series of five dealing with our interpersonal styles and stress. Today we're going to focus on expressive personality, so you're going to learn a little more about who I am. But first, let's take a look at our stress chart. We have. You see on the horizontal line, we've got stress as it increases. You go over here on the left-hand side, we've got performance as it increases. You can see that as stress increases, performance increases up to a point. So in reality, stress is our friend. It's not toxic like a lot of people think. It's not a poison. It is a friend. It gives us the energy to do what it is that we need to do, but it can become toxic. As you can see, performance can decline. So we'll talk about what we can do to keep on the left-hand side of that line. So let's take a look at our personality chart. We've got assertiveness here on the top, and going from low to high. You can see that the higher we are with assertiveness, the more energy that we have, the more willing we are to tell people what we think. Over here on the left, we've got people, and also going from low to high. The higher we are with that, the more important relationships are for us. And you see it results in the four characteristics, analytical, driver, amiable, and expressive. Today we're going to talk about expressive. As you'll see, they're high on both of those characteristics. So you, because they're high on both, you swear to God they're perfect people, wouldn't you? Well, sometimes they think that. But here's what you've got. You've got somebody who's high on energy. They like to get things done. They also like the attention associated with getting things done. They're extroverted. Right? They know a lot of people. They like to know a lot of people. It helps them feed their ego. Variety for them is the spice of life. And their theme song is Let the Good Times Roll because they generally have a great sense of humor. Some may think that we're talking about the typical uh, sales personality. Well, in reality, there's another personality called ambivert. If I would take extroversion and put it on a continuum from introversion to extroversion, uh, ambivert is right in the middle. An ambivert has both character, some characteristics of, of highly extroverted people as well as introverted people. We might do a video on that sometime and you can also Google that and take that test. So, what causes stress in these people's lives? Well, they can have too many irons in the fire. Um, with particular short timelines, they hate structure, they like freedom, they like their independence, kind of do their own thing. They hate too many details. Those causes stress. So how do they react when they're that way? Well, their backup here, because they've got so much energy, their backup is, is to fight or flight, get away. Well, what they will sometimes do is they'll blame other people or other situations for when things go wrong. They may show extreme emotions. They may overreact and start throwing mud up against the wall, thinking that if I throw enough mud up there, something is going to stick. All right, so they have a tendency to overreact. They may struggle with managing time and priorities. So let's talk about what we can do in order to control that. Just like everybody else, they've got to get control of themselves. They've got to tell themselves, stop and think, Larry. Do I want to make a good choice or a bad choice? A good choice, of course, is staying calm. Take a deep breath. That always is helpful. Take a deep breath. Soften that tongue because it can be kind of sharp during stressful moments, during stressful times. Most importantly, perhaps, though, is establish priorities. What needs to be done? And then slow down. Take one item at a time and get it done. I know sometimes I'm under, I'm under high stress. I have a tendency to get 14 things going at the same time and want to walk around through those 14 things. But i got to slow down and do one thing at a time. Exercise is always great. Sometimes you need to just go take a walk around the dealership. Get rid of some of that energy. Last but certainly not least is be kind to other people. Expressives have excellent interpersonal skills. Use those interpersonal skills to be kind to other people. Well, there's a few things that, are, that we can do in order for expressives to do a better job at managing their stress. And the next time we're together, we're going to talk about amiables.